I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you in this tutorial, this Canva tutorial, how to convert image into sketch in Canva. Mm -hmm. This used to be very easy and uh, about a year ago or two in Canva, but now you just need to find a workaround, a solution for this problem because we can't have that app, which it was called, I think it was called uh, Glitch and uh, now we can't find an app anymore so we're gonna have to use a workaround so what you can do here is first to look for your photo that you want to convert into a sketch so i'm just gonna look for a portrait of someone here so i'm gonna select this one now we're gonna have to go to image here and just rem background remover so we can of course remove the background we don't need the background and it's just like uh, there's way more processing if you add with the background so there's really no point in adding the background so that's why we're gonna have to use you remove the background now we don't have a background now we're gonna have to export this uh, image but before we're doing that please pay attention you're gonna have to actually remove this if you have a background just remove it and uh, remove that as well and now we have only this uh, picture and here's something that i have to mention is you need to you need Canva Pro because here when you click on Dolan, we're gonna need transparent background. So we're gonna have to check this button, transparent background, and click on continue. But just just make sure you check transparent background. Okay, and now let me download this. PNG, it's fine. Now we're gonna have to head over to this website, photo mosh, choose the file. Here I'm going to select this one here and then here we have solarize and we can increase this this effect. We have a lot of effects here but uh, but here you just have to check this uh, button here so click on this button here and I'll just check just play with this uh, brightness so with power I we'll like to have the details for the hair as well and colorize. We don't need any colors, so drag to zero. Now we can save this. We save this, and now I'm gonna go to uh, to Canva and upload this image. I can now upload this image. I have this image here, and now I have a um, sketch. I have a sketch. Uh, image i can click on edit image and click on remove background all right now i have removed the background i have the background here can just uh, resize this very fast and maybe i can add a background from here now part two so another way now to create a sketch and this is actually due to the fact that we have this a nice app in canva we can click on apps here so here you should see apps and here in the search bar we can look for we can look for this app photo stylist photo stylist and you click on this one here you click on open now open and now we need to choose the original original image apply the style of the another image or select an option so i don't want to choose uh, but you can which is super interesting here that you can actually if you want a specific style you just need to plot that style so apply the style of another image or select an a option so you can apply the style of another image you can choose that image if you want the specific uh, sketch style and then you can upload the original image the uh, image that you like that style from so i'm going to click on this one i have this image here i want the sketch effect now i can click on generate image it's only gonna only it's gonna take a few seconds so don't worry here just uh, be patient and uh, wait a couple of seconds now here we have the results we have this nice sketch effect actually it looks pretty nice and now i just have to remove the background i don't need the background i just want the uh just the sketch all right so just remove the background okay this looks actually really nice i really like it now but also i'm gonna curious i'm curious to try these 
so i'm just gonna add this image again but i like to try this abstract let's see what's the result and i'm gonna move here this result here and for the abstract okay it looks again i really like the effect uh, the results uh, we got some really nice results so let's remove the background removal sorry let's remove the background and wait a couple of seconds now we have this result i'm gonna move it here and now let's go to elements and here i'm gonna search for a photo portraits let's search for another portrait photo and here i'm gonna look for i'm gonna uh, use this one now so i'm gonna move this in another in another um page and now i'm gonna go to here to share and here i'm gonna click on download i only want to download the page two so click on done so i after i save this now i can go back to apps and so i don't have to go to apps just the last app you used it's going to appear the last one choose file and here i'm going to choose this one i just downloaded it and now i'm going to select sketch and now let's click on generate image so this is the original image and now let's see the results okay and it's done okay so the sketch actually again looks really interesting it, there's no detail it's only the outline or not the outline but the general kind of characteristics of that image but i think for just a sketch simple sketch i think it looks okay and you can use this for a lot of designs ideas so i removed the background and now this is the result it looks really nice so now let's see if what if we add a, a landscape so let's go out to still go back to photo stylish and here i'm going to choose this uh image i'm going to go with uh, this one now I have this image here. I'm just going to select this style, this sketch style and generate image. And I'm really curious if it adds actually all the details for all the of the landscape only or maybe works better with uh, portraits. So we're going to find out right now. So we just need to wait a couple of seconds. Oh, it doesn't take that much. And now here's the sketch. So yeah, the sketch actually looks really decent. Like you can crop now. You can crop now and actually edit all some parts here. So yeah, looks pretty nice. Looks close to a sketch. We can edit some parts here and saturation tint and blur blur we don't need blur and clarity if you want highlights play with vibrance and shadow so yeah our sketch looks pretty nice now let's also try i'm gonna try this again for a profile picture for a face I'll try this one sketch again and generate your image so which is gonna wait a couple of seconds but it works actually pretty well for images for landscapes as well we're gonna try again a landscape and then uh, that's gonna be it so here's the example for this portrait and as I said, it still looks pretty nice look at the sketch simple lines but you know for a simple line you can even you know just with the simple simple line and you can really recognize the which who is that person you know so you don't have to really create any any hyper realistic sketches you know but uh, this one just for a profile picture for a profile picture to add to your social media or your design it will look quite nice so now let's uh, try with the la landscape with this link uh, landscape again and click on generate your image so let's wait a couple of seconds and let's see the result okay yeah looks pretty nice we can also click on here to select this and then here we have crop so let's crop this image uh, freeform sorry and now 
I can click on done and now I have this sketch and again I'm pretty happy with the result leave your feedback down below your questions or your thoughts if you like this feature the sketches and if you're gonna use it so let me know in the comment section thanks for watching and take care